you want to do the last one? I can't. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Sent sugars down my body. See what I did there? I did. <laughs> nice, one. nice one. So Dave can't do that, or so he thinks. The, the next one is ruling out that little word called can't out of your vocabulary. There's no reason ever to use it. Well, I suppose maybe if you're tied up or something like that. Can't well, I'll put it team. this way. I can't jump from here. I can't jump 20 feet from where I am. That's a physical fact. Yeah. There are facts out there that, yeah, you can say I can't, like, can't jump out the window. That That's that's really bad. But you can't. <laughs> yeah, actually, okay, that was a bad example, and I won't. Uh, but the thing is, there are certain physical things that we can't, gravity and things like that. However... Yeah, using the word can't implies just it's not possible for the person. Yeah. Uh, I always make the kids aware of this. Like, I really believe educators are in a position that when it comes to lessons like this, like if somebody's saying they can't play their E minor to G quick enough, that probably means that they're saying they can't do other things too outside the lessons. Yeah. And now whatever they do outside lessons is their own business. However, when I show them saying, John, you say you can't, <clears throat> This is what you're really saying here. And then, like, I don't know how to yet. Yeah, yeah, I yeah. usually reframe it uh, f- into that for them. Yeah, because can't is so permanent. I can't. Well, it's, yeah, it's not solution-based. Yeah. I mean, that could go on forever. Yeah. And, uh, but it's very powerful, you see. It sends, it sends a message to the, your brain and your body that yeah. and it just puts the thing way further away from where... You should be so I can't yet, yeah, or I'm unable to do it yet, or I haven't figured this out yet. And adults do this though, like okay, oh, yeah. I'm I'm on for having the crack here, but I'm getting deadly serious for this last part. Or your adults say I can't the whole time, and if you've people of whatever age saying they can't do something, full stop. That's there's no yeah, there's no I couldn't even segue into the solution there by saying I can't. Yeah, there's whatever. no comp- it's so permanent and definite, yeah. like yeah. Yeah, it's, it's, uh, I think, you know, like you listen, there's so many podcasts out there now and stuff. And as I said before, I'm a bit of a sports buff. So when you listen to like coaches and stuff like that, like same in business for any people who's bu- who are building a successful team, they mo it's pretty much common practice that they'll identify that word and they'll remove it from their workplace or from their from their ethos from their team or their yeah. ethos yeah. yeah yeah i mean it's it's commonly known stuff that 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 stuff has a very detrimental effect on your psychology and on your attitude i can't i can't so uh that would be a huge one if you're in the habit of saying it and some people say it and they don't realize the power of it which is when it's mm. it's most dangerous i suppose because people say i can't i can't i can't and they don't like they might be positive people otherwise and well, check this out. I go, geez, I can't do that at all. Yeah. Like, bit of a smile, bit of a bit of a playful nature to it. But the content is there to say, yeah. I can't. Exactly, yeah. Yeah, man, I've said I can't more than I've said it in the last year, I'd say that. Yeah, I know, me too. <laughs> like, and here's Body the thing. It weird. It doesn't, like, of course, the positivity side of things, it's not about going, I can. Well, do you know, there's some things I'm terrible at, and I'll admit it, and I don't have a skill set. But if you get your student... To realize that it isn't about them, it's about their skill set in that area. Now you've isolated what they're saying they can't do into something tangible that's an activity. And all of a sudden they go, Oh, and then I'll be like, Name another activity that you thought you couldn't do when you were younger. And they go, Well, there was this one time. And I said, How did you get that? Yeah. And then, Well, I did. And it's like, it's repetition, it's knowledge, it's uh, practice, it's the usual components. Yeah. And it's so easy for them to forget that. And especially if they're if they're in an environment where they're hearing loads of people around them go, I can't do this, I can't. It gets stuck in their head for them. Yeah. And it's an acceptable excuse then as well sometimes. Yeah. Which is not where you want to be heading for. So that's number seven. And that do is... Do a whole podcast on that word. It. <laughs> yeah. That's coming down off the board after the save. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs>